Y'all come on in to Miss Dana's kitchen. children like the boxes at Christmas time better than the presents. Well, Nico has found a paper cup and he is playing with it. So whenever you hear a little background drum music, it's him playing with this really pretty paper cup. But anyway, here we go. So this is actually a recipe that we're going to post after Thanksgiving because I think it would be so good to use for leftovers because it's just so different. And the the reason I came across this recipe or worked on it was because uh, we went to Bourne, um, this beautiful restaurant in New Orleans, and the chef came out to talk to us and he said, you have to try the broccoli. And believe it or not, <laughs> um, the broccoli is more popular than the french fries. So. We came home, worked on it, and I think it's just something that you are going to love. So we had one package, an eight ounce package of cream cheese, a fourth of a cup of whole milk or heavy cream, whichever one you like, a fourth of a cup of feta cheese, and you just wanna really blend it until it's all incorporated. And you can see why everybody would love this because it is so rich and yummy. But you can also, like if you have leftover squash or green beans or anything like this, I happen to make it with broccoli today. But this base would be excellent for any of your leftover veggies. So we're gonna add a half of a red bell pepper chopped up. And I just think for the holidays, red bell peppers are so pretty. And a green onion chopped up. A clove of garlic chopped as fine as you can get it. I'm not a great chopper on garlic, but I try. <laughs> so we're gonna stir all this together. And see, it's already looking really pretty. You could actually make this for a dip, couldn't you, Charlene? Mm -hmm. I think that feta cheese, you could use uh, cucumbers with it. Oh my God, it would be so good. Yeah. Okay, two uh, teaspoons. Let me make sure this recipe is on MissDanasKitchen.com and in my cookbook, so I'm going to make sure that I get it right. A tablespoon of Creole seasoning, and I like to use Slap Your Mama. You can make your own Creole seasoning up, though, if you aren't near um, a place, or you can go to a spice shop. If you have a spice shop near you, we love the Savory Spice Shop in Franklin, and they are wonderful at blending things and helping you decide what you like. They'll, let, they'll blend something and then let you try it. A teaspoon of salt. A half a teaspoon of black pepper. And y'all, this is it. <laughs> this is the whole dish right here and I'm, I'll show you how we're gonna plate it up. And this is the way they had it plated up, which I just thought was so beautiful. So I put the mixture on this beautiful plate that my sweet friend Sue gave me. It has magnolias on it, so you know I love it. They served it in a cast iron skillet, which looked really pretty too. And then you just, I roasted this broccoli, not for a long time, at 350 with just a little olive oil and salt and pepper for just about 10 minutes. And then you put your broccoli on top of your dish. All this beautiful cream cheese. I'm gonna do it like this. But I was just so fascinated by the fact that he said all their customers, you could choose your own sides. We're asking for this broccoli dish instead of the french fries. And they have a lot of seafood, so french fries would kind of be in order for the evening. But, um, but I'm telling you, this is a Creole cream cheese that you've made with all of the things that you've put in it. And actually, whenever I first posted that, whenever I first published it in my cookbook, Slap Your Mama reposted it because they liked it so well. And so um, it's just a really, really, really easy and yummy recipe. Now we have toasted some slivered almonds. And you know, we love pecans too. You could use pecans if that's what you have, or just kind of whatever you have left over from Thanksgiving. If you have walnuts, I think that would be fine. So here you go, broccoli with Creole cream cheese. I think you're gonna love it. 
It's on MissDanasKitchen.com. Bon appetit, y'all. <music>